Good morning, friends. Welcome to this week's video. Just threw my hair into a braid. I wanted to let you know, today we are going to be doing a wellness fit girl vlog. We're gonna be chatting fitness, fitness tips and favorites, nutrition, lifestyle. So this vlog has everything to do with our physical selves and staying at our very best. And in case you wanna become a little wellness fit girl yourself, then this video could be helpful for you. Today is going to be centered around that. I'm gonna take you through my workout, not just show you my workout. So I'm getting ready for the gym right now. It is 10 a.m. on a Sunday. First thing is gym makeup. I know we all feel different about it. How do you feel? Yes, makeup to the gym, no makeup to the gym. The only gym makeup I really will do is this much concealer and then some eyebrow gel. It just makes me feel a little bit more alive when I look at myself in the mirror. My beverage is here with me. So first thing in the morning, I try and get some of my supplements in. I've been drinking AG1, you guys have seen this before in my videos, this is a huge amount of vitamins in this little green drink. And then right here, I also have a protein smoothie that is basically done. So I guess that's like my first health tip is make sure you are getting in your vitamins. When it comes to nutrition, obviously daily supplements are super important and you should not skip them. I'm gonna add a bit of cream bronzer just to tan my face a little bit. Okay, now let's get dressed and head to the gym. This is today's gym fit. I'm wearing this sports bra and short set from honor active i wanted to chat to you that this is my new all-time favorite athletic wear their stuff is just so soft so flattering and it's just like the cutest stuff i ordered a haul from them because i had such old gym clothing and i just wanted something that was gonna make me feel good make me feel confident and that's honestly a tip i have for you is get some athletic wear, it doesn't have to be expensive, that makes you feel good in your own skin. I honestly believe in like, look good, feel good, and if you feel like you look good, you are going to have so much more motivation to show up to the gym. I personally have better workouts when I love my little fitness outfit that I'm wearing. I wanted to share this brand with you because it's so much cheaper than Lululemon and Aloe. Another thing I love doing is a pump cover up. It's basically just wearing like a huge oversized t-shirt. So that way you feel like comfy. You're also not worried about how you look. And then once you start to get like really warm, you can take it off. I honestly just leave it on most of the time. So if you really want to be a little gym girly, tuck it into the back of your sports bra kind of just like this you do this so that way you got some coverage in the front but you got a little pop in the back these are my training shoes that i'm going to use today these are nike metcons i love the shape of these i think they're so pretty i'll have them linked down below this is pretty much the complete gym fit i feel cute i feel ready to go crush this workout <laughs> Okay, now I'm going to make my pre-workout. This is like the last step I do before going to the gym. This is the one I'm currently drinking. It's by BPN. You can also drink coffee before a workout, espresso. And honestly, for like three years, I was not drinking pre-workout. Um, and then when I tried it again, I was just reminded how much more enjoyable it makes your workouts and how much easier it is to get through the workout when you have a little smack of caffeine like that. And I've been liking their supplements a lot. I also have their electrolytes. The powder? Yeah. Also gonna make my BCAAs. I do know that they help with recovery. I do a scoop and take it to the gym, drink it throughout my workout. These are pretty much the two supplements I drink when I'm trying to get pumped up for the gym. So I have resistance bands in here. I have my own ankle attachments for the cable machines because my gym doesn't have one. I recommend if you can get your own attachments because the ones at the gym are just usually gross. And this gym bag is from Amazon. It's a really nice quality. It has like all these pockets inside and everything. It was only 30 bucks lifting straps. Not because I lift a lot because my grip strength sucks. And I got everything in pink so it's all like cute and it matches. All right guys, I'm going to use my wired headphones to try and do a little mic'd workout. We are gonna start with my workout program that I have been doing. I'm on week six. I'm using the Evolve U app. I will put a screenshot of my workout on the screen in case you wanna try it. 
first we got 12 reps of squats. Light warm up to start with. Three, four, nine, 12. Next is leg swings. You're gonna do 15, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. What you do to one side, unfortunately, you must do to the other. Two, six, nine, 10, 15. Moving into a lunge stretch. These are my fave. Four. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Guys, I'm so nervous about filming in the gym. This is like the only place I'm so shy to film at. But I'm gonna do it for you because I love you all. Okay, we're starting with some barbell RDLs. I like to warm up with an unloaded set. Okay, I think we can whack some 10 pounders on this baby. One, two, three, four, five, ten. Okay, next we got some single leg RDLs with the landmine machine. Love these. I'm using 25 pounds on the end of it. 12 to each side. Two, three, six, eight, 10, 12. I also untucked my shirt so I'm not flashing the entire gym. One, four, seven, eight, 12. Good set, guys. Alrighty, next we have some glute bridges. This is a superset, which means we are going to do this in the next exercise back to back with little to no rest. And then after this, we have frog pumps. Eight, ten. We're going straight into frog pumps. I'm gonna use a resistance band for this one because it's no weight. Two, four, six, twelve. Okay, guys, we have made it to the final exercise. My favorite exercise of all time is dumbbell RDLs. I'm gonna use 30. This is the heaviest I can go. And I'm gonna use my wraps because I can't hold I will drop it. Three, five. 12. Time to static stretch now, which means the very slow stretching because you definitely need to cool your muscles down after any type of workout. I like to get in the sauna like two to three times a week. Um, it feels like a good detox, get some sweat out of me. Uh, we found a farmer's market, so let's walk through, see if we find anything. Got coffee. You guys know me and my beverages. I always have several on hand for whatever mood I'm in. Chugs. <laughs> Agua fresca. <It's> so <laughs> okay, this is all the goods we got at the farmer's market. Two cantaloupe. And then they had like some sourdough corn starch, some potato and egg, and bean and cheese tacos to you right now. I was gonna cook lunch, but I'm so hungry that I'm just, I'm just gonna eat what I got at the farmer's market. Mm -mm -mm. They were like making these tacos fresh out there. <laughs> it's so good. If possible, I like to try and eat or drink a shake within 30 minutes of my post-workout. It's 3.20. And if Sundays aren't for getting dressed at 3 p.m., what are they for, right? Okay, I'm gonna do some really light makeup because, guys, it's literally like 110 degrees outside. It's so hot. We're just gonna chill here. I have some stuff to get ready for the week.
Okay, here is the outfit. I wanted to keep it super comfy and casual. So I put on this crew neck from the Museum of Peace and Quiet. It says natural on it. I also thought it was fitting for today's video. And then I have on these gray biker shorts from a brand called All Things Golden and just threw my hair up into a little low ponytail. And now it is actually Lola's birthday today. She's turning four. Renee bought her a bunch of little gifts. Um, so I'm gonna set them up, assort them, and then we're gonna give Lola a little birthday surprise. Also, who else gets way more excited for their dog's birthday than your own birthday? We got her a bunch of like treats. Lola is obsessed with chasing squirrels. So we got her this like interactive toy and there's like squirrels and you put them in the trunk. This little birthday cake. Lola! Guys, look at Lola's birthday outfit. <laughs> look at Lola's birthday outfit, guys. Look, these are for you. Melon. I've been trying to eat more lately get more consistent with my meals, which means snacking. Okay, so I showed this in one of my last videos that Renee and I did like a planning session together at the beginning of the week and it helped so much and we haven't done it since that video. Okay, so this is my planner and this is Renee's planner. I put them on because this is honestly, in my opinion, the best agenda. Any wellness or like healthy habit that you're trying to stick to, um, the only way I'm able to stick to like a healthy habit is if I write it down. So all my workouts, I like to write them in the weekly spread on the planner. And honestly, it holds me accountable to showing up to the gym. I like to write my meals in here too. the week we wrote down meals workouts uh i scheduled some content that i have to do and uploads i just went down to get some packages and saw that i have this big package in from naked fashion one of my favorite clothing companies thank you so much to naked for sponsoring this part of the video i picked out some super summery pieces so i'm going to show them to you i'm so excited to wear them which i swear like half of my closet is from them at this point they have the cutest capsule pieces, the cutest workwear pieces, lounge pieces. They're always up to date with the trends. So if you're looking for like trendy items you've seen on Pinterest or on socials, they will definitely have options that you can choose from. And if you see any pieces or you shop their website and you find something you like, which I'm sure you will because they have such cute things, you can use code Annika for some money off at checkout. All you have to do is make an account with them and sign up to activate the discount code. I picked stuff up for like summery beach time. I got these Terry shorts. This is from the Josephine HJ collection. Look how cute these are for the pool, for at home. I would wear these right now if I wasn't already dressed. And I will have all of this linked down below. Next, I got this pastel yellow off the shoulder top. I feel like this is my color for the summer. I'm so into this color right now. This buttery baby yellow is so pretty and this top looks so pretty with some white pants. I got this blue and white button down shirt. I think I'm going to wear this unbuttoned as like a cover up over a tank, a swimsuit. It's just such a summery like staple item to have. Some white shorts and like a little bikini under. Next, on that same note, I got this white button down. This one's a little bit of a thicker, different material over a little bralette or a tank top as like a summer cover up. Oh, I'm so excited about this. I have seen this trend on my Instagram. So I found it on their website. It's this long white maxi skirt. And I believe there's a, yeah, and there's a slit in the front. It's like high-waisted, has a zipper on the side. Then I got these blue and white striped pants. They're super 
wide leg and then they cinch at the waist. I just thought this with like even this white button up open and then like a little bra under is so cute. And I feel like everything is matching really well, which is how I love to shop. Next, we have, these are the same shape as the pants that I just showed, wide leg, flowy pants. And these pants are a set with the white button up that I showed. Next, I got this crew neck. I love a good oversized crew neck for summer as a cover up if it gets cooler at night. And this is kind of giving the vibe of what I'm wearing right now. And this one I bought in a medium, so it's like, baggier and looser. It's just this cream colored crew neck that says NYC on it in this really pretty green. Let's go through these last pieces. I got a pair of jeans. I love the wash on these. I have one pair of jeans from Naked Fashion and I wear them all the time. They're baggy, but they're a little bit of a lighter wash. These are mid-waisted. Next, I got this tube top. It's literally just a black tube top. And this is a really nice, like stretchy, kind of spandexy material and this in any time of the year is a really great staple to have okay last two things are swimsuits so the first one is this gorgeous white crocheted swimsuit it's a little string bikini and i'm so excited to wear this white bikinis are like my favorite thing because on tan skin it looks so pretty and the second swimsuit is this really pretty floral print it has these baby blue flowers on and this one has some underwire so it's more of like a structured top and the matching bottoms they have some super cute swimsuits on their website and then the very last thing i got is an accessory i got some sunglasses it's supposed to be like y2k like with an outfit i know right now i just kind of look like I look like that guy from the Cheetah Girls. It's gonna serve when I have a whole outfit on. <laughs> that is everything for the Naked Fashion Haul. I'm gonna hang all of this stuff up on my clothing rack. If you want to use my code, it is only valid for the next seven days. So make sure you shop and use it. Okay, while dinner is being prepped, I am going to fold all of this clean laundry. This is also the part of the evening where I try not to get on my phone or anything. I don't want to have screen time right now. So I was reading right now for a bit. I'm still reading things we never got over. Do anything that doesn't involve me scrolling, keep myself busy. Okay, so basically for dinner, we did like a one pan dinner. These are super easy because you just throw in the ingredients obviously on one. And then you can make some sides if you want, but there's a ton of different variations you can do of this. And they're just my favorite because you just throw it in and you basically don't even have to cook. This is dinner. It's like a chickpea veggie bowl. Usually when I'm thinking about what I want to cook, I try and make sure that I have like a little bit of food group in it. As chickpeas for like the protein, quinoa for the grain, avocado fat, and then your veggies. Guys, oh my gosh, it is getting really toasty in here. Um, I was outside right now on my balcony and I'm sweating and it's dark. Okay, it's time to take off my makeup and I think I'm gonna do a face mask. I have a little flare up here, so I'm gonna do a face mask. Here's a tip if you break out, I have my ice roller and if you just lightly run it over like inflamed areas on your skin, it kind of helps with the swelling. I'm gonna do one of these Loops Beauty Patches. Um, I don't want to do like a clay mask because I used retinol last night. So I'm gonna use this Loops mask. It's a sheet mask and it feels really good on the skin. I'm gonna use my roller and like roll over the mask and it feels so so good just to help the breakout be like less inflamed 
a huge part of physical wellness for me is recovery make sure that you are like keeping your body at the best shape that it can be in and whether that's like stretching or rolling out my body or taking an epsom salt bath like some form of recovery is important um so i'm gonna use this like oh i'm gonna use this like theragun dupe that renee got at target and i'm watching a christy cello video on the tv <laughs> I'm trying to put the duvet on the bed. It looks like someone has taken it. It's the next morning and I just wanted to end this video here because last night I fell asleep without getting to end it. I hope you enjoyed this wellness vlog. I have been so passionate about it lately that I wanted to film a video surrounding it more and maybe this can become like a series of vlogs on my channel that are more like wellness focused in terms of like health and fitness. Thank you all so much for hanging out with me. I love you guys so much. Make sure to go follow me on Instagram and TikTok and threads now. I mean, I'm pretty active over there. I love it. It's like our little group chat. So definitely go follow me on threads. I love you all and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.